Hi, and welcome to Chick Beer with Hophead and Porter. I'm Hophead. And I'm Porter. And tonight, we're trying the Voodoo Love Child by Voodoo Brewing. Sounds awesome. It does. It's all kinds of red and crazy. Mm. And check out, okay, this just cracks me up because it's very silly. The label is pretty great. It's this dude in his underwear with a helmet on. Yeah, I mean, and he's kind of fat. Yeah, and there's flames around him. And it's called Voodoo Love Child. It cracks me up. It's great. It's that's like pretty random. The the football helmet is it really makes it. <laughs> it's a nine point five percent. So excellent. It's actually higher than I thought it was. Beer. I thought it was in the eight percent range. No, this is this mm-hmm. is in the we the like to just range. go for it on chick beer. <laughs> What's interesting about this ale? Because it is an ale, is that it is aged with cherries, raspberries, and get this. How cool is that? I'm really cool. curious to try it. I'm I will really try really anything with fruity passion fruit it is. in it, quite frankly. Well, it's I wonderful. love the flavor of passion fruit. It's delicious. He's wearing... He's got clogs. clogs on. He's got clogs with little... Oh, it's awesome. Like, and, and socks with stripes, too. Yeah, look at that. This He's is got, it. like, gym socks on and, and these wooden, wooden clogs. Very traditional clogs. Yeah, indeed. Oh, that's great. It's very odd. Oh, I'm, let's pop this open and just go for it. I'm, uh, I agree. Where did I put? There it Hopefully goes. it won't explode. No, see, I'm opening it. I know how to open, you know how to pour. See, we're, it's yin and yang. It's a symbiotic relationship. It is. We need each other, otherwise we both fail. <laughs> <laughs> you pour. Excellent. Mm-hmm. Indeed. And we're using goblets tonight. Uh, we thought this is a Belgian ale. So we thought we'd go for a goblet style glass. And these are actually kind of a family heirloom kind of thing. Which yes, they are. Makes them more exciting. Woo, look at that. It's very color. light in color. Mm-hmm. I think it's probably the label. I was expecting I expect it to be red. reddish. Yeah. I think it's the label. Yeah, it totally is. All right. Well, I'm really curious about this. See how light it is? But it's the thing very is, light. you can see a lot of sediment floating around in there. Yeah, it's, it's very lot. cloudy. It's also very fizzy. Mm hmm. Extremely fizzy. Oh, it smells awesome. Fruity? Very cherry, but very really? light. I couldn't pick out any of the fruit. Oh. It smells fruity overall, but I couldn't pick out any actual fruit. Oh man, the cherry is yeah? very evident. The cherry is very heavy. Let's I'm, taste yeah, I can't wait to freaking taste this. Cheers. Voodoo Love Child. Oh. Oh yeah. Heavy it tastes on, like soda. It's heavy on the cherry. It tastes like it's like fruit punch soda. See, I'm not getting fruit punch. Oh, I am. We got a lot of cherry. I can definitely and, taste um, the cherry. It, but it 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 tastes like a lambic, just not quite as sweet. I don't think it tastes like a lambic. A lambic has that little bit of a wine taste to it. This doesn't taste anything like that to me. It has an edge of it. Like, you can feel it go across the top of your palate. It has that whiny, kind of sweet, kind of sour taste. Maybe like a and little tiny bit. And then it goes into massive but not much. ale taste. No, I don't even taste ale. This tastes like I'm drinking a, a fruity soda. There's a hint of what you were just talking about. A very slight hint, though. And other than that, it just tastes like super car- carbonated, fruity drink. What would you pair this with? I honestly don't know. I can't think of anything Bread? either. <laughs> yeah, maybe just something to eat. <laughs> that has very little flavor. Because if you're drinking this because you enjoy it, I think you'd probably just want that. Maybe with peaches. Some sliced peaches. You know what would be really That'd good, be good with this, actually? actually? I think peaches would be good. It's like a little light, little, little, little couple flakes of sugar on each. That would be really good. What? Some marinated mozzarella cheese. Marinated in what? Like, it, it comes, you can get it marinated in, like, Italian spices. Oh, I don't think so. I just think that that texture... You know what, though? I think some mozzarella cheese that was mixed with, like, a peach reduction or something peachy. I think it would be really good. 
I think the cheese would actually be good with the, but I think the fruit is what you need, not the Italian spices. Hmm. So, order. Would you buy a six pack of the Voodoo Love Child? No. Mm. I might buy a single bottle of the size because it's pretty freaking big. Um, but no, I wouldn't buy more than that. I think um, this is definitely not beer that a lot of people would enjoy. I don't think. I don't know. It's it's different. It's not bad by any means. It's just it's very odd. <laughs> I'll put it that way. Um, I think you know, just kind of chilling out, or you know, one or two people hanging out, it might not be you know a bad like novelty thing to try, but um, yeah, I wouldn't like keep this stocked or anything. <laughs> it's not like a Midas touch or you know any of that. So right, um, yeah, I mean it's not bad, not bad at all. It's it's tasty. It's just different. Would you buy a six pack? No. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like this. I could drink pineapple soda and have the same exact feeling. I don't enjoy it. I just pineapple soda and a little bit of vodka. I could have the same feeling and oh. pretty much the same taste. I don't. En- I'm not enjoying this at all. You, it might notice I have not refilled my chalice. But you're gonna I've fucking drink it, aren't it. you? I'll drink it because we're doing chick beer, and I will drink anything on chick beer. That's the point. We fucking drink juice, for God's sake. Drink I will again. drink this. Because this is a lot of juice. Yeah, it is. But no, this is not a beer I would like. But you know what? I would recommend this beer to people who don't normally drink beer. I would. Absolutely. Because it doesn't taste like beer at all. It tastes like fruit soda. Yeah, that's your opinion. I don't know what I the hell you're God, tasting. But it feels like a beer. It feels like a strong beer. I mean, I'm definitely... I haven't had that much of it, and I am definitely feeling the alcohol effects of this beer, because it's high. But I think, like, light beer, I think she might like it. I don't think she will. You don't know that for sure. She. Anyway, I, I would recommend this. I don't think it's complex at all. <laughs> Personal opinion. We we're, we're totally opposite on this beer. And that's like a beautiful pterodactyl face that Paul is making right now. Thank you. In the middle of my review of the beer, you decided to be a jackass. <laughs> Jesus. No, I wouldn't buy a six pack, but I would for someone who doesn't like beer, I'd totally be like, you know what? You might like it. You could give it a shot. Interesting. But for myself, hell no. I'll never have this again. <laughs> Jolly good. Jolly good then. <laughs> yes, we must swear. I need a monocle and a cigar. <laughs> you, I Picture was the monocle. For English sophisticated. You were going for pirates. <laughs> <laughs> pirates drink out of chalices too? Yeah, I know, but they don't wear monocles. That's it this week for Chick Beer. Tune in next week. And if you have any questions or recommendations, please email us at hophead at hopheadreporter.com and visit the website, which is awesome, at hopheadandporter.com. Yeah. Mm. Uh, Drinking beer. Not oh, good beer. Oh, this oh. beer sucks. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers. We love you. Please email week. us. Tell us what to drink. We will try it, no matter how ridiculous it and sounds. And if you want to drink beer with us, please email us yeah. as well. We're open to that. We're cool. We are. You do the traveling. We'll mm. provide the beer. We need the backdrop. It's very important. <laughs> Fills us out. <laughs> Makes us crazy. Yeah. Cheers. From Hophead and Port. Dot com. Dot com. <laughs>